Hi friends, welcome to this session. In this session, we will see how you can auto start a build agent in interactive mode. Uh, that too, when your VM reboots and you don't need to log in into it. So to achieve this, we will enable auto login feature on the VM and then we will add the shortcut for the build agent to start up in the startup folder. So let's get started. You can see I have a virtual machine windows and this is acting as a build agent build agent running on this it is up and running and if you've seen my project the build agent is on so now you log into this VM and you can see the build agent job is running to enable the VM for auto login we'll start the run dialog box and we'll type a command control space user passwords to to enable the auto login for the user when the dialog box opens up just uncheck this users must enter a username and password to use this computer we'll uncheck this and when you will say apply provide the username using which you want a windows to auto login and give a password click ok and again ok so now windows vm is set up for auto login now we'll create shortcut for the build agent so that we can add it to the startup so right click on the run command file and send to desktop shortcut you've seen desktop we got this shortcut created we'll rename it to start build agent and now we'll run this shortcut to see that it works fine and you can see it is right now create uh, connect trying to connect to uh, the devops so build agent is connected i will stop this right now and i will now add the shortcut to the startup script so we'll open the run dialog and type this command shell colon startup so once this folder is open now we'll move this shortcut into this folder so we'll drop it here that's it so all set now and we can now stop and start the VM to confirm that build agent automatically starts. So you can see build agent is right now down. I will stop this VM now. So it has stopped. And now let me start this. So VM has started now and within few seconds we'll see the build agent should also come up and we refresh once and here you go so build agent started in interactive mode and we log into the VM now to confirm that yes the build agent did start in interactive mode if the dialog the command prompt should be open uh, for the build agent to be running in interactive mode and as you can see now here the build agent is actually started in interactive mode thank you guys for watching this video